Is pornography ultimately hard for you? Follow, stay tuned by the end of the video so you know what these things are. But if you guys are new to the channel, okay, my name is EJ Madden and I help you quit pornography in less than 30 days to lead a righteous marriage. So let's go and hop into the video. So fellas, let's go and talk about this. Uh, listen, you know, there's so many things that we can talk about when it comes down to why pornography is hard, but these points that I'm gonna tell you in the video are some points that you may have never heard before, okay? So let's go and hop into it. So we have to look at point one, fellas. Point one is that if a man is indulging inside of pornography and lust, yeah, ultimately that leads to soul ties because the truth is whatever it is that you put your attention to and whatever it is that you're putting your your flesh to your spirit to okay that can create soul ties something that we don't want that something that we don't want okay because the truth is we look at matthew 19 5 and said for this reason a man should leave his father and mother cleave unto his wife and the two shall become one flesh we are not called to become one flesh with porn stars sex outside of marriage hookup culture and adultery right we are called to become one flesh with our wife. And ultimately what happens is, you know, if a person watches pornography, okay, uh, one thing that happens, you know, back in the day when I used to do it was there would be a specific actress that I used to go to, right? And ultimately what, what it is is that it's making a covenant with that woman and also in the spiritual realm becoming one flesh with that woman, something that we don't want. So ultimately, you know, when it comes to quitting pornography, you know, we don't want to make a covenant with that woman. Right? We want to stay away from that, okay? And so that means in order to leave that, okay, in order to leave that, you know, covenant, you have to pray. You have to pray against that. The word says, call upon me in the day of trouble and I will deliver thee. So there's going to be a soul type prayer in the description, okay, down below. Okay, listen to that prayer daily to get rid of that, those soul ties, but you need a cleansing of your, of your kingdom, right, to get that restoration, you know, off your land. And ultimately, you know, getting away from, you know, fleeing away from it. Right, that's highly important balance. So ultimately, the reason why pornography can be hard for some people is because they're making a covenant with the actress inside of the um, uh, porn. And that's gonna go with point two, fellas. Point two is gonna be dopamine receptors. So th as you can see, fellas, the kingdom of God is gonna be within. It's not external, it's not that person over there, or that person, but the kingdom of God is gonna be within. So everything that you do okay, on a day-to-day -day basis, it can affect your dopamine receptors. Okay, your dopamine receptors are a state of where, you know, it wants more and more. It wants excitement. It wants to feel good, right? And so pornography is the easiest access to cause that dopamine receptor to go to an unusual spike, right? And so whatever it is that the dopamine receptors are putting its attention towards and getting the release, the, the spike towards, then what tends to happen, it's gonna want more and more. That's the reason why a person cannot get tired of it because it wants more and more. So it's not just content with just temporarily, you know, temporary things, but it wants more and more. That's the reason why some people go from regular P to now this weird P. And all, and all of the pornography is not good, right? But that's what happens, you know, to the dopamine receptors. So how to get that dopamine receptors back to its natural frame is by releasing and quitting pornography for good. That way, your mind is not focused on wanting more and more of it. Okay, so that's gonna be key. Right? Now it's gonna go with the third point, fellas. Fellas, the third point is the fear of missing out. So as you're going upon your journey, fellas, know this. Okay, the fear of missing out is something that because everyone else is doing it, it doesn't mean that it's always good. It's just like with social media. Obviously, social media can be something where okay, because that person's doing it, or because that person's doing it, you know, I should do it as well. No, no. We wanna stay away from that. We wanna make sure that, you know, you're doing this not just for yourself, but you're doing it for God. You're making sure that you do it for your future spouse, okay? 92% of American men do the do, and 96% of British men do the do as well. Again, that shows you, fellas, again, just because the broad do does it does not mean that you have to do it as well. So I want you to make a deal with yourself to say, dude, okay, just because everyone else is doing it does not mean I have to do it. And, you know, so you have to make, so you have to make, so you have to make a decision, fellas. The fear of missing out can be comfort as well, right? Being comfortable inside that current situation of going to pornography. But that has to stay away, that has to leave, right? Because there's a whole person waiting for you on the other side of, you know, uh, uh, lack of pleasure. There's a whole person waiting for you. There's a whole new person waiting for you, okay? So just because it's comfortable does not mean it's always good. So that's the reason why pornography can be a little bit difficult for some people because it's comfortable. So we want to stay away from that, okay? 
So the three, the uh, three ultimate keys is number one. Okay, you want to make sure that you lead that covenant with the person inside the um, the video. That's the reason why we're gonna have a soul tie prayer down below in the description. Go to that, keep listening to it. It's gonna help you out. Number two, causing the dopamine receptors to go back to its natural frame. And lastly, making sure, okay, that this is not a comfortable thing, right? Fear of missing out. Now we wanna stay away from that. Highly important, fellas. And if you guys enjoyed the video, like, comment, subscribe. If you ever need any help to quit pornography, to finally lead that righteous marriage, become the ultimate man and leader that you were called to be, go down below, okay, in the comments, okay, see if you need any help. And I will catch you on the next video. Peace out.